Winston Churchill had an uh, incredible amount of energy. And on the other hand, he had the foresight and the ability to accomplish just about anything he touched. Now, in his family history, there was a strong bipolar alcoholic trend went through the Churchill family for three or four generations. In his depressed days, he would sit quietly and uh, not talk and uh, stare into space for weeks and weeks on end. During his high phases, his, was the energetic but, but a healthy energy that you know was very strong and to the point and he could, he could command uh, armies and, and countries and had the greatest respect of anyone during that particular time. He clearly had a bipolar illness, but if you try to give him a treatment, he'd probably reject it and rather sit in a depression for three months first and then come out to be the old Winston uh, carrying on and winning the war.